Hello, Archibald Chesterfield III here, AC3. AC3, fuckers! Remember, like, subscribe, and tell your fuckhead friends. And this email comes in. A poor man always pays twice. Let me explain, fuckers. Let me explain. Archie, hope Singapore is treating you well. If I was there, I would shout you a meal somewhere and sit down afterwards with a nice cigar and single malt. Unfortunately... I won't be in Singapore till the Grand Prix in September. Thought you may be interested in the below email I sent to one of your competitors. He is a charlatan of the first regard and should be denounced on every level. Here we go. Your YouTube video, frequently asked questions, white gloves, my non-posh British accent, conspiracy theories and real job was recently brought to my attention. Naturally, I watched one or two other videos you have posted and it occurred to me that you have a strange need to subtly drop the supposed bloodline every now and then. It seems very unveiling. With this in mind, I impugn that you are charlatan. I have been fortunate to liaise with many families in rich in nobility and not one of them thought it was acceptable to be benefit themselves based off heritage. I would also suggest to you that many old aristocratic families, particularly the contemporary generations thereof, have a tendency to conceal their nobility even if it is diluted. To me, it seems you are the only one who has bucked the status quo and chosen to blatantly advertise your supposed bloodline. This is verging on boastfulness, which all, which you of all people should know is distasteful. I would be, it would be like calling yourself the governor or some other attitude of irreverence. I also find it incredibly ignorant of you to suggest members of the establishment have the propensity to ask for favors or get out brothers or get you out brothers, bothers. That point alone is evidence to suggest that you have no idea what you are talking about. I don't know what establishment, modern or not, you think you're part of, but it certainly isn't one of any, oh, it isn't, it cer but it certainly isn't one of any decorum or indeed integrity. If you haven't guessed already, I too have an immense app, Antipathy to charlatans who claim to be part of a class they evidently, they evidently, they are evidently not. If you are part of any modern establishment, you would be aware of the roads and turnpike story. It is often recited hourly at the Anthenium Club along other, among other gentlemen's clubs, I'm sure. I am not asking for proof or an undergraduate public school discussion on your flawed perceptions of the establishment. Nay, these are merely points you should at the very least consider. Best regards. P.S. P.S. If you would like to add a decent timepiece to your collection, our office regularly consigns pieces to the Christie's Watch Cattle auctions. I'm sure your underbidding would be welcome. It may be be a place where your white gloves would be of use. Yes, indeed. This is from Alex. A poor man always pays twice. And I got to tell you, I think he's a charlatan, a con man, and a nasty, vicious fucker. A nasty, vicious fucker. Archie Luxury. For the poor Pluto channel, reporting the truth, fuckers. Nasty vinyl Fucking charlatan cunts! We specialize here in pre-owned Rolex watches. Rolex watch is a very special timepiece and we always do the servicing exactly as factory specifications. We buy a pre-owned piece and we put it into brand new condition. We have Rolex certified technicians working on that. We completely disassemble the piece, we adjust and polish and change every single part of the watch. 
you have to have certified watchmakers that know what they're doing. If you have an expensive car, you're just not going to bring it to any mechanic that doesn't know what they're doing. You spent $5,000, it's like if you put money in the safe deposit box. And one or two years from now, you will keep having your $5,000. We have to spend a lot of money to get all this equipment together, but makes me feel I'm doing what I'm supposed to do. It's not a question of money, it's my passion. Jewelers on time, simply the best.